Hey guys, welcome to our channel. Today it's all about me and Nikki. We're going to do a resort haul for you guys from a brand called Hello Molly. Hello Molly, from my understanding, is an Australian brand, but they do ship to the U.S. I purchased from them before. I have loved everything that I've gotten from them. These I just got in the mail. I've never tried them on before. So this will be a fresh haul, fresh review. I'm not really style, styling them with like shoes or accessories or bags. I'm literally just going to throw them on. I might throw a shoe on and just really just review the item, tell you my size, tell you where I'd wear it to, etc., etc. So I'm going to put on the first outfit here and let's get rolling. Okay, this first dress is this really pretty maxi dress. I love the cutout detail on it. I have a mirror right here, so look this way. Um, I love the cutout detail. It goes all the way around. This is a smocked top right here, so plenty of stretch. There's stretch right here at the waist, so this would be considered, in my opinion, bump friendly if you are pregnant. So much wiggle room. So I am in a US 2, which, if I understood right, is an Australian 8. I always recommend if you are shopping an Australian brand like Hello Molly, Petal and Pup, Sabo skirt, I would always recommend sizing up because I have found in those Australian brands, in my opinion, the clothes run a little small, especially if you are a lifter like me and you work your back, you work your lats. I have a hard time sometimes fitting in my normal size tops because my lats just don't, they need more room. So I would size up. But this one, there's a lot of stretch in it, so you wouldn't necessarily have to size up in this. I don't have shoes on, but it's 5'4", and it goes right down to the tops of my feet. Um, we are in Arizona, so this is going to be perfect for an Arizona spring. We've never had an Arizona spring yet because we just moved in July. But I think this is so cute for a Sunday out with the fam, going to the pool. It could absolutely be like a cover-up too. So, so cute. All right, next one. Okay, next we have this silk mini slip dress. I think slip dresses are so sexy. Um, I also think that they are the most simple thing you can wear. And what I like to wear um, with slip dresses is cowgirl boots. I think they're the perfect dress to really use your accessories, your shoes, even a jacket to spruce up the outfit and let the dress be the more simple piece of the outfit. So in this dress, I actually sized up to a medium. It said on the website that there was no stretch. And like I said, I kind of worry about my lats in some of the Australian brands. So I sized up to a medium. It fits great. It's a little bit loose, but I feel like I'd rather have it a little loose in my booty area than have it too tight and just not feel comfortable. Um, so again, this is a medium. If I remember right, they did have it in other colors. I really like this detail right here on the bust. Um, for reference, I am a 34B. I'm not wearing a bra. Um, I usually don't. If anything, I wear like little pasties right here. But I think this is a very pretty dress if maybe you are a bride and you're doing like a bachelorette party, any sort of bridal event. I think it's very, very pretty. And I'm definitely keeping it. So, okay, next one. Okay, next is this two-piece set. Um, I love sets because you can obviously wear the top with denim or a different type of bottom. You can wear this skirt with a different type of top. Maybe you want to do a plain white top. Um, I am wearing a size, gosh, I think it's the US 2 in this one. Um, I would say if you are a bigger chested gal, this top probably wouldn't do great for you. It's really only supported by this little string right here. Um, again, I don't wear bras usually. I just wear little pasties, so just be aware of that. But in general, the top is very cute. I love the balloon sleeve on it. Um, the skirt is very stretchy. Again, I would say bump friendly if you don't mind showing a little bit of skin during your pregnancy. I think it's very cute. Um, I think the print is adorable. I'll come up one more time so you can see the print. It's kind of like a rust with an orange. It's very boho. I feel like this set reminds me of Free People. The only downfall is the set has to be purchased um, individually. So you have to purchase the top and the skirt. You can't purchase them together. So just be aware of that. So you don't have to get both pieces together if you don't want. But I think this is such a cute beachy pool look and I just kept my little cowgirl boots on with it. And yeah, I think it's a win. So next one. Right. 
this cube. Perfect. Yeah, this is cute. Okay, so this color is very pretty. It's two-tone orange. Um, I'm in the smallest U.S. size. Again, everything, um, the links, the sizing that I'm in, everything will be in the description. Right now, I'm just kind of going off memory. Um, but this is the smallest U.S. size on me. Um, I will say that this bow is the only way to make this top tighter, so right now it's a little loose on me. So just know that you'll have all your faith in this little bow. But I love this back detail. Um, I'm 5'4 for reference for where the mini skirt hits or the mini dress hits. Um, I will say too, there's not a lot of material to this. It's thinner than the other silk dress. I feel like the other silk dress was double lined. This one literally feels just like one layer of a scarf. So just be aware of that if you're somebody that likes a little bit more coverage, maybe with shapewear or you just, you know, a good gust of wind could really do a number on this skirt. But it's so cute. So in my mind when I purchased this, we're probably going to Florida here in the next month or two. And I was just thinking of like beach and warm weather and just like carefree and that's where I feel about this so again everything that you saw today in the description I'll have the sizes I'll have the links if you don't follow me on like to know it I am on like to know it at Nikki Schmieder underscore fit and that's the same handle for my Instagram um, you can find everything that I share on both platforms um, so hopefully y'all saw some goodies today for your next trip resort beach day what have you and give us a follow and what do you call it? Thumbs, Thumbs up, up yep. and whatever, do all the things. Okay. <laughs>